The D-3122 mm howitzer became the standard Soviet artillery battlefield system in 1963, replacing the aging World War II era 122 mm M30 model of 1938. The original system was developed to serve in support of motorized rifle elements equipped with the BTR series of wheeled armored personnel carriers APCs. On the whole, the D-30 became a largely conventional artillery piece, reliable and robust under battlefield conditions, making it a favorite of Soviet allied nations and states during the Cold War decades. It still serves in surprising numbers on today's battlefields, 2015. The D-30 is cleared to fire standard FRAGHE, fragmentation, high explosive, and heat FS, high explosive, anti-tank, fin stabilized, rounds. It is also capable of launching chemical rounds including TNT detonated sarin gas types. Rocket-assisted projectiles, RAP, extend the range of the weapon to that of 21,900 meters, 13.6 miles. Sustained fire by a capably trained and well-experienced gunnery crew can reach 4 to 8 rounds per minute. The gun has an elevation and depression limit of plus 70, dash 7 degrees and indirect fire and direct fire is possible. The gun mounting hardware sits atop a tripod base which also serves as the two-wheel tow unit. Traversal is a full 360 degrees from center line. Recoil is handled through a hydropneumatic system. As with other artillery pieces, the D-30 is towed into action. For Russian and related forces, the primary mover vehicle has been the tracked MTLB or Ural 375 wheeled vehicle though many other haulers are possible replacement candidates. Design of the weapon system has been attributed to FF Petrov with manufacture through the Motovilika plant. Several variants have been manufactured beyond the original D-30, which also carried the designator of 2A18. The weapon has been produced locally by China, Croatia, Egypt, Iran, Iraq, Yugoslavia, Serbia, and Sudan resulting in various localized designations appearing. The Egyptian D-30M model has been featured in the Egyptian self-propelled gun SPG, platform as the SPH-122, American M109 howitzer chassis, and T-122, Soviet T-34 tank chassis.